guys, so it guess what? It really matter. We just got a notification that our Airbnb in London got cancelled. Here's the dilemma. <laughs> We never really wanted to go to London anyways. I did, but it's too expensive. I did too. But you know, we, we but everything was in order and we were going. We were on en route to going to London in a few hours, but our Airbnb got cancelled. Like and we were just ago. thinking we had a lot of fun in Barcelona. We really haven't seen enough of Mallorca. What if we just either bought a flight or just extended our stay in Mallorca instead of going to London? Yeah. We were trying to figure out the opportunity cost of you know, missing flights and buying another flight and staying at hostels. It all kind of works out, to be honest, because the Canadian dollar to the pound is shit. So the spending money and the accommodation that we have to account for, I mean, it's just all too much. And when we're there, it's raining and it's nine degrees. You know, now that I'm actually talking this out loud, <laughs> Really though, oh gosh. and it's a, it's a weekend. So by the way, we also booked the last minute accommodation thanks to Tanisha's hotel discount um, in London for cheap enough. But now we're trying to see if we can cancel it so we can save some money there and just book a cheaper hostel in another city somewhere. But if if the language on if the language on the confirmation had said 24 hours, I would be having this, this discussion, but that's not what it says. It says canceling your reservation, I'm reading it verbatim. You may cancel your reservation for no charge until October 19th, um, and then in brackets it says one day before your arrival. It doesn't say anything that says 24 hours, which would have 100% clarified and solidified what you're saying to me, asking you to empathize, and because I, like, I do understand there's a reservation team, but I also understand that you're a manager and working at a hotel, I kind of know how it works. Okay. All right, Leo, I do appreciate this. Um, now, I am going to cancel this reservation. I'm taking your name down, but if there's a way for you to note... Yeah, absolutely, not a problem. I'll just... Oh, was it friendly? No, you weren't. I think I was. I think that's friendlier than you. Oh, we recorded it. <laughs> <laughs> you guys let me know. What's not friendly? Okay, okay. What are we gonna do now? So, tomorrow's flight, which was forty-five dollars for you, seventy dollars for me, is going to waste completely. Is that what's happening? Because the cancellation is thirty pounds. Oh, it's in pounds. Yeah. So even worse, I don't even know if I'm gonna pay that myself because. So we're losing um, forty-five dollars, and that's plus it. you're paying, let's say, about twenty dollars for the new flight. Yeah. yeah. So they were at sixty-five. Yeah. It would have been expensive. Like the bus alone, and I. It was twenty pounds. We're talking about twenty, 20 pounds. Twenty pounds. And then pounds. Pounds. the metro on top of that. Twenty pounds. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Per person. It's like a sky bus. Yeah. Twenty pounds. Yeah. So forty but, pounds. Yeah. Back and forth. So we're looking at, but at least we know that food costs would be low and we wouldn't pay anything to go out. Exactly. Here's the difference. This is why we're not, you're not seeing what it is, is because we're expecting to save that $75 because we, we lost our Airbnb. Mm -hmm. But if you want, so if you want to compare it to what we would have paid originally, then you're not losing out. If you want to compare it to what we would have paid with the hotel, you're losing out a little bit. At least save 50 bucks. And get a dollar croissant and a coffee and be good for the day. And they eat, you know, wait until they go after the dinner. Oh, buy, buy wine between 9 and 10. Drink it in a room. Wait until they leave to go to the bar. Okay. Then go take the leftover food. Just accommodation and transportation and what we're losing out on on the flight, you're ending up paying $80 more to go to Barcelona. If we stay in Mallorca, we'd have to look at some places to stay. Let's see on the other side. Who said 85 euros? 80. Two euros. 82 euros, euros from my problem, my, my to London. Oh, yeah. On Sunday to get yeah. there on time. At, at 9 a.m. Yeah. So that's basically over $100 plus my bags. That's probably 150 So that, So I guess Barcelona is apparently the. We're losers. <laughs> we're losers. Guys, do you think we're losers? <laughs> Let us know in the comments below. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, so after that whole deliberation, we decided to. 
buy our flight back to Barcelona. Barcelona. Just because, I don't know, we had a great time. It's cheaper than paying in pounds for us Canadians. And it worked out to be around the same. So off we go. And we only got like, what, 45 minutes of sleep? Team no sleep. Guys, we made it to our new hostel. It's currently 9 a.m. and check-in is at 3 p.m. So we don't have anything to do until then and we're tired as hell. And this hostel just so happened to have a king-size bed in the common room. It'll fit three of us and it'll make do. But thank God, public. sleeping in public. Guys, I'm so glad that we made a decision to come back to Barcelona because this weather is popping, popping, popping. Look at this blue. So what had happened was, when we made our last minute decision to come back to Barcelona, a big factor was that things were gonna be cheap and that we wouldn't have to pay for the nightlife because in our original hostel in Barcelona, we didn't have to pay for any nightlife. We got all, like, all our covers for free. So, we booked a new hostel because it was just, we needed to see another cute part of town. Yep. It was a lot cleaner. It's a little bit, the standard's a little higher. However, it's like super strict. They charge you for the night crawl and like we weren't used to that. So we're like, let's see if we can like leverage our connections that we made in the past hostel and you know, have a great Saturday night and not have to pay any covers. So we, call, we called up our old hostel and just randomly asked, hey, what club are we going to again? We forgot. And then they told us the name of the bar and the club and what time they'd be there. So now we've left our hostel, who's gone on a night crawl for 15 euros, oh to come God. meet up with the old hostel and try to see if we can get into a club for free that on a Friday night. So we're at, at the bar now. We're going to see if we can bump into anybody that we might recognize and see if we can leverage this connection. So we'll let you know we'll how, it, how goes. it goes. No, maybe they're inside. I Tom. Who's Tom? The, Come, let's go. You know Tom Marco. <laughs> All right, so we found the we found the people that we called inside, but we just need the pride to go in guys, and actually. Pride is starting to kick in. This is actually embarrassing. You, you know what? <laughs> come, guys. We come, we come. The logic is there, but then you gotta think about embarrassment. Oh, but Tanisha has Tanisha has no shame. Celebrities. The plan works. <laughs> the plan check. Works. check, check, check. Everything free. Uh, uh, your birthday. Barcelona. Oh, 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 Yo, can I please be in the vlog? Yeah, 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 go, 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 go. Havana, oh no. <laughs> oh no, no, oh no, no. Hey. That song is so fire. It is fire, right? That song is so fire. You're in Barcelona and it's 4 a.m. and your plan worked to a T. <laughs> Guys, y'all heard about that plan, you know? We told you we're not paying that 15 euros to go out with our and own hostel. This? I know. We have so many free drinks tonight. The Too super, many. The super strict hostel. We told you we weren't doing it, and we didn't. And it's about 4 a.m. now, and I don't want to show you the state that some of these people are in, but as you can see, stop! It's a it's a red light. Jesus. As you can see, the state we're in. Oh my God. 
keep moving, keep it moving. Oh.